Shalom, I'm Angel. Welcome to Healthy in Heart, and I hope you are healthy in heart, mind, body, and soul today. So, if you remember, I was telling you that, um, oh, you know, we love our spices here. We love them. We use them in everything. And I've told you that I have a lot, and I was reorganizing. Um, it's still not organized the way I want it to be, but it is organized a little better. So here are my spices. Da, da, da. Okay, so they don't, they're not just right there. <laughs> I have a few back here that I don't use very often. And on the very top shelf, I have um, my my blends, my spice blends, my spice mixes, uh, like the savory spice blend from Dr. McGregor, my cheese mix blend from, uh, well, it started out as Miyoki's blend from her cookbook, but it, I changed it. <laughs> um, and everything, basil mix, pizza seasoning, apple pie spice, pumpkin pie spice, and taco seasoning. This is my dry ranch dressing that I use um, I put it in a mixture of plain yogurt and, um, a, there'll be a recipe for that coming up. Um, Cajun seasoning, curry mix, poultry seasoning, steak seasoning, my red chili spice mix. That one's super awesome. Um, I'll do a recipe for that one as well. Garam masala, um, Italian and the herbs of Provence and then we have all of our hot peppers right here as you can see we have a lot of spicy peppers right there and then over here is our peppercorns and our speaker for when we go when we jam on preparation day okay second shelf is just spices alphabetized the ones that fit in the small containers for what I could fit on the shelf um, it would be nice if I could have, uh, have a little more space there, but I don't. So it is what it is. I told Todd, we're going to have to make a shelf that just fits. That's just as wide. That is just as wide to fit all of these. And it's going to be floor to ceiling. So I can just see every single one of my spices that I have. <laughs> so this is the other ones that, um, uh, we use a lot of, like we have the, cardamom pods, star anise, somewhat in alphabetical order, the basil back here, um, cinnamon, I have cinnamon, cinnamon sticks under here, cinnamon sticks right here, um, and then another larger container of the cinnamon because I use that a lot. Uh, cloves, whole and ground, nutmeg, whole and ground, um, mustard and mustard seeds, cumin and cumin seeds, smoked paprika, um, chives, sage, thyme, Saskatchewan pepper. These um, have a little bit of a numbing quality in your mouth if you chew on them, um, but they intensify flavor. So that is one of the ingredients in my red chili spice mix. Um, parsley, oregano, uh, sesame seeds right here, and then back, and then I've got poppy seeds. Um, orange peel, tomato powder, and then all the way here on the side, all spice berries. These are some other spices that we use all the time. Um, crushed red pepper, minced onion, onion, and granulated garlic or powdered garlic. And we use it so often, they're in larger containers and they stay beside the stove. So that does it for my spices. Spice, you, you don't have to use a lot of just salt and pepper. You can, and when I'm talking about flavor, I'm not just talking about salt. Um, these guys add a lot of flavor and they have a lot to offer if you add them into your dishes. And like I said, we go through these like crazy. So I don't need even need to date these because I'm having to replace them so often uh, because we use it in everything. Um, some more than others, but still, none of them last a year. None of them usually last for half, half, um, for three months. So, um, there you go. But this is my spices. Um, thank you so much for joining me. Yahoo bless you and keep you and give you shalom. Until next time, God bless.